uh, networking night was incredibly beneficial in that it, it offered a much more intimate uh, setting where there were employers who came knowing that I was a veteran, that I had the training and background that I had, as opposed to being in a room with thousands of other more traditional, less experienced students. I would absolutely recommend the Veterans Networking Night specifically because, you know, you're, you're exposed to jobs that are more tailored to veterans, to people with, with the kind of training and the kind of backgrounds, the kind of careers that we've come from, with the education that we've just gained or are gaining, and who know uh, specifically where we want to be in the workforce. Yeah, I think for me, it was a positive experience because the networking night was the night before the, the regular job fair, so it was kind of like a, a warm up to what I can expect having the big job fair with a lot of different people. Um, and it was nice because I got to go there, have more of a one on one you know, relationship with the employers, and I saw those employers again the next day. So when I went up in, to the booth again and I talked to them, they knew exactly who I was, so it was much easier for me to take that next step and to get that interview. For us, sometimes with veterans, they've never had a job where they had to apply, where they had to, to interview for. It was kind of like, hey, you're done with high school, join the military, sign on the dotted line, and then that's it, and that's all you know. And then you come to school, and then you do school, and that's all you know. So, so having this is a really cool way to let us know, like, you know, we don't know everything. We're not perfect. There's, there's things that we need to do. There's people that we need to use as, as tools to help us. This is a great tool to help. Um, there's very few schools that I've talked to from friends that go to other universities that do things like this where the Career Center will come out and specifically target veterans to try to help them succeed. Um, I think that's a really unique thing that Florida State University does and I'm really proud to be a part of that university and proud of that organization that helps the veterans. You know, initially, um, the Career Center offered a, a resume workshop specifically for veterans, and the purpose was to take our military service, our experience, even the jobs we had in the military, and, and translate those onto what would stand out on a resume, which was incredible. I had a very specific job that was very hard to translate into the civilian world, and the Career Center definitely helped me do that. Um, you know, beyond the resume, after I sent that out and got interview options, a lot of them, because I want to work in federal service, were in D.C., and those, the initial interviews were done via Skype or some online service. Um, now you think about an interview, it's kind of a no-brainer, you've done it before, but a Skype interview is kind of weird. There are a lot of minute details and, and do's and don'ts that you have to remember, and so um, I was given the opportunity to work with the veterans liaisons, go down to the Career Center, practice Skype interviews, and, and you know, I got the hang of it enough to where I was able to, um, to successfully navigate this, this online interviewing process, and I was offered a job. I think my experience is unique. Um, I think, you know, for me, my senior year, I took SDS 3340, which was the Intro to Career Development class. Um, and I took it as one of my 3,000 level electives. And I took it because I was really confident in my skills. I thought that I was a good resume builder. I feel like I could interview people and people could interview me and I would do really well. But I knew that I don't know everything. Um, and I think that's something that took a while for me to figure out, especially as a veteran, because the, when we come into college being in such a structured environment that we have this extreme level of confidence that we can really do whatever is thrown at us. Um, and I think that it's really important for, for all students, but especially student veterans, to realize that there's help out there um, and it's not a sign of weakness to find help, it's a sign of strength to utilize the tools that are available to you.